absolutely spectacular performance. The biggest fight of your career and the best performance of your career thus far. Thank you so much, so much, Joe Rogan. I'm, of course, proud, but I was working so hard all my life. I don't get nothing easy. I always work for it. So that's why hard work always pays off. Well, it was without a doubt the hard work paying off because for you to do that to a guy who is an Olympic gold medalist and a two-division world champion, that really sets the stage for you to fight for the title next. Of course, eh? but uh, last couple of months, Mark, Mark Zuckerberg was my supporter, and he just came for support. And of course, I have another extra corner here. He was giving me some tips. That's why everything was beautiful here. I was dabbling. I was smiling. You guys see me. I'm not even breathing heavy. I don't even feel it. I'm in the fight because I am every day fighting in the gym. Every day, training, grinding. Like I said, hard work, space of. Without a doubt. You had, the, the moment that you had in the second round where you were choking him and looking over at Zuckerberg and laughing and smiling, I mean, that was a tight choke. Yeah, that was a tight choke. Uh, but just a couple seconds left. And I want to just dominate all rounds. I want to just feel the... I want more rounds, guys. Three rounds is nothing for me. I want a 10 round fight. Where is champion? Bring me here right now. Bring me this fat, fat guy. Now I'm sure he's like... like bring me, country. Everybody wants to be fight. The champion, every fight, you know. I thank God, thank UFC. I don't have to work anymore. I quit my job four or five years ago and I'm just training full-time fighter. I'm enjoying my life. I, I, I love New York. I love my team in New York, but I moved back because I want to be focused and I want to be full-time fighter. Well, Marab, next month, Sugar Sean O'Malley and Marlon Vera will fight for the title. You will be next after that. Give us your thoughts on that. I'm ready. I'm ready for 10 rounds. I said, whoever will be champion, I'm going to face him next. And I'm just going to fight. I've been calling Sean O'Malley since 2018. I was just calling him, but now whoever will be champion, I don't care, I just love fight, but my only goal is for title now. Remember you asked me, Arjo was next to me, and then, big respect, Joe Rogan, but, you know, he's my brother, you know, like, nobody sent us contract. I love him, of course I don't want to fight him, but if UFC sent us contract, maybe we fight, but I love UFC, you know, it was so many champions that time. But hey, also one more thing. All the Georgians who came here, look at the, all the flags, all the support. Thank you. Sasa, I love you, Sasa. Thank you, brother. Thank you so much for And then everybody, everybody. You get, and then, you get, you get, yes, yes, too. I know, I believe, uh, Ilya Topuria will be champion tonight, and he will beat my favorite fighter. Alex Okanuski is my favorite fighter, but Ilya is my brother. I believe in him. He's working so hard. Good luck, Ilya. You got it, brother. Marab, enjoy your victory, sir. It was beautiful to watch. Congratulations. Marab Dwabachwili, ladies and gentlemen.